when you are using Power Query, it takes over your Excel window, so you can switch to another workbook easily. Opening a separate Excel window means you can use Power Query and still work on other files at the same time. Basically, it's like having two independent Excel applications running side by side. Alright, let's dive into the first method. It's probably the quickest. Hover your mouse over the Excel icon in the taskbar, press and hold the Alt key, click the scroll wheel. Keep holding Alt and when the pop-up shows, hit Yes. Simple and effective. Method number two is pretty similar. Right click on the Excel icon in the taskbar, hold down the Alt key and click the Excel icon again. Keep holding Alt until a pop-up shows asking if you want to open a new window. Just hit yes and boom. Or maybe you want to open a specific file in its own window. No problem, here is how. Find the file you want in File Explorer. Double click it like usual, but immediately press and hold the Alt key. If you will press Alt too soon, you'll just open the File Settings window. It needs some practice. So there you have it. Whether you are working with VBA or Power Query, these tips will save you time and frustration. Until next time.